Oh man, you know AB, Ancient Biscuits, Anchor Blues. What up, Fight World? It's your boy Ego, and I'm back with some more boxing. Make sure you guys like the page and also subscribe to the channel. And I did a video about this already. I'm just doing an updated video. So make sure you check out that previous video. It's an Ego Rumor Mill video. And it says Adrian Broner to stay at 140. No welterweight move. Ricky Burns is likely. And it looks like that is true. In addition to that, it looks like Broner's going to the UK, Glasgow to be exact. Now, right now, I'm on Matchroom Boxing, their verified page, Eddie Hearn, Matchroom Boxing. And you guys see this. I'll expand it for you. Broner next for Burns if he beats Kirill Relic. Hashtag Burns Relic. So, obviously, he has to defend his title against his mandatory. But they're saying if he's successful, it looks like Broner in December. And the camps have already talked about this beforehand before the thing i think that happened broner was dealing with that bowling alley assault case things of that sort so he had some trouble outside of the ring so i think they just decided to get their mandatory out of the way and let broner handle his stuff which he really just beat the case and now i think he's freed up and he's gonna go in the crowd and, and get a closer look of ricky burns now this fight was actually supposed to happen years ago when broner was doing damage at 135 and better late than never i'm knocking all you bitches broner actually responded to eddie hearn too if you guys after the anthony corolla jorge linares fight you guys see right here broner says see you soon because he's going to be out there and they've already had conversations so it looks like that's the fight that has happened in december and it is what it is broner's money i mean if he was able to sell the fight with ashley theopain then I think he can definitely sell a, a title fight with Ricky Burns. And the thing I would like to see is if he's going to the UK just to be in the crowd to watch this fight, that would be cool to see Broner go to the UK to defend. You know what I mean? Terrence Crawford did it versus Ricky Burns and a ton of other guys. All the UK fighters, a lot. Kell Brook came to the States to fight Sean Porter when he was champion. So that would be cool to see Broner. Plus, he, I mean, the UK fans are, are loyal. Um, and they don't get the opportunity to see Broner, <laughs> Justin Bieber. So I think that'd be cool if he fought him in the UK. I think that would be big for boxing. And November, December looks like it's popping in boxing anyway. You got Nicholas Walters, Vasily Lomachenko, Orlando Salido. He's fighting against Miria. You got Ward Kovalev, Pacquiao's fighting. And it looks like some good fight. So just to have Broner back, that's good. He should be coming in fresh. This is Broner's verified page, and it looks like he's in shape. He's Diesel, already training for December. Now, he put hard work, hashtag about billions. The only thing I'll say, he looks like he's in shape. He, he's definitely coming down to weight, putting his miles in and, and doing his road work or whatnot. He just looks big to me. I don't know if it's just his his frame. like the, He kind of has that Canelo type of like big ass, thick ass neck for his size and, and stuff like that. So I don't know. It's going to be interesting to see him make 140. Based on this, he looks in shape, but he looks kind of big to me for 140 based on his height and, and, and whatever. So let me know what you guys think of this Broner coming back, possibly to fight Ricky Burns, most likely if Ricky Burns is successful, has a strong performance. But Broner will be in attendance for the Relic fight with Burns. Drop in the comment section. Let me know your thoughts. Who would win, Ricky Burns or Adrian Broner at 140? Drop me a comment. Make sure you like my video as always. Hate, comment, and subscribe. Till next video is Ego, signing off.